Incoming National Security Minister Itamar Ben-Gavir sparked a meeting when he spent 13 minutes on the Temple Mount, the first visit by an Israeli minister in almost five years. During the emergency session in New York, the UN and a parade of nations, including the US, criticized Israel for the visit. Secretary Blinken has said very clearly that it's absolutely critical for all sides to exercise restraint, refrain from provocative actions and rhetoric at the Haram al-Sharif Temple Mount and other holy sites in Jerusalem, both in word and in practice. In this spirit, we oppose any and all unilateral actions that depart from the historic status quo, which are unacceptable. Israel's ambassador to the UN, Gilad Urdan, slammed the meeting and said he was shocked. And why? Because there is absolutely no reason that this emergency session today should be held. None. To hold a Security Council session on a non-event is truly absurd. To claim that this brief and completely legitimate visit should spark an emergency Security Council session is pathetic. Security Council session on what? Former Israeli ambassador to the UN, Danny Danon, served five years at the UN and told CBN News the Palestinian Authority was behind the emergency meeting. It's part of the diplomatic terrorism of the Palestinian Authority. You know, they put pressure on the representatives in the Security Council to call for a meeting. They would come spread lies. No, it's not helping the Palestinians. It's not helping the peace process. It's part of the blame game. For his part, Itamar Ben-Gavir maintained his visit, did not violate the status quo on the Temple Mount. The Temple Mount is open to all. Muslims and Christians come up here, and yes, also Jews. In a government I'm a member of, there will be no discrimination, and Jews will come up and visit the Temple Mount. After Ben-Gavir's visit to the Temple Mount behind me, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu issued a statement saying that the status quo would not change. That's where Israeli police prevent anyone other than Muslims from praying on the Temple Mount out of fear of disturbances. Chris Mitchell, CBN News, Jerusalem.